guys, it's Graham from the Taos Avalanche Center. It's Wednesday afternoon, another beautiful day, and we're just out sniffing around, looking at what these recent wind slabs are doing. Where this, where this wind slab is still soft and not cohesive, you guys, we're finding really nice powder skiing actually at low elevation, mid elevation stuff. Um, it's not behaving cohesively, like I said, there is evidence of a very weak layer about a foot down in most places. That's that depth is going to be dependent on how much of a wind load is there. So if you can find slopes that aren't affected by the wind, and this is stuff, this stuff on top is still real soft and fluffy, skiing's been great. The, the exception to that is up higher or at the base of cliff bands like up here above me, where that slab is starting to behave cohesively and we've seen naturals the last few days in that harder slab. That, um, that natural activity has backed off a bit in the last 48 hours or so, but we're still a little spooked of some of those harder slabs because if you do find that trigger point, you're gonna be taking a ride with some, some gnarly chunks and the potential then for stepping down into weaker layers in the snowpack. So if you get out, you know, just be heads up of what's been affected by the wind and what hasn't. And if you, you're still, we're still finding really nice powder skiing in, in and among the trees and down low. Um, and some of the fans. Just be conscious of what's above you. Be safe out there and let us know if you have any uh, observations from the field. TaosAvalancheCenter.org. Thanks.